I call the member for the Northern Tablelands and Minister. Thank you very much, Madam Speaker. <clears throat> Last fr Friday night, I had the enormous pleasure of attending the second annual Urala Business Chamber Business Awards Night at the Urala Showground Business Event Centre. Uh, I do acknowledge uh, the Minister for Finance and Small Business, Damien Chutope, who also uh, paid uh, due honour and respect to the Urala businesses by being there on the night to present the major Business of the Year award. This event recognises the ongoing achievement and success of the small town's thriving business community. And I say thriving because despite the fact that Urala is a population of a little over 2,500 people and 22 kilometres from Armidale, it is quite rightly, with its boutique retail and hospitality sector, it is quite rightly a day tripper's dream and fast becoming, arguably by some, the, the true CBD of the city of Armidale. And you can't blame them for thinking that, Madam Speaker, because on a Saturday and a Sunday, you simply cannot get a park on the New England Highway, the main street of Urala, as people from across the region, even from down the hill at Tamworth, come up to Urala to pull in, soak up the town's heritage, locally grown food and beverages at the wonderful cof coffee, coffee shops and other eateries in the small community. At a time of extreme drought and economic hardship, as everyone knows that our state, but particularly the Northern Tablelands region, is going through, it makes me incredibly proud to see the Urala CBD thriving, which has a tenancy rate of nearly 100 per cent. You will struggle to find an empty shop anywhere in Urala at the moment, even though we are in the grip of the worst drought we've ever seen. The business chamber has been strongly led by President Theresa French, who is the owner of Thunder, Thunder Graphics, the secretary of the chamber, Corinna Nets of Sunhill Dairy Goats, treasurer Darren Stevenson of Emergency Planning and Safety Consulting. They have done a magnificent job in concert with their committee, Macca McIntosh, John Buckingham, Russ French, Colin Hull, Wayne Howard and Sonia Reppin. They have done a great job getting this chamber off the ground and running these wonderful awards for the second year running. I want to. Uh, acknowledge uh, all of the recipients of awards on the night. There were four categories, excellence in customer service, trainee apprentice youth, excellence in customer service volunteer, excellence in customer service employee and excellence in customer service business. And, uh, and I'll now run through the winners of those prestigious awards on the night. Uh, Linda Harvey from Urala Pharmacy won the excellence in customer service trainee apprentice youth. The first runner-up was Taylor Whitten of Urala Preschool. Second runner-up, Lockie, Lockie Barnden from Dale's Downtown Meets. The finalists, uh, Simone Ryan, Lauren Acton, Alex Cormack, Gemma Wegulin, Finn Macon and Melanie French. We move then on to the second category of the night, excellence in customer service for a volunteer. The winner was Anne Edwards, the first runner-up Jan, Jan Kayla and the second runner-up Michelle Williams. The stellar cast of finalists, Erica Bargwell, uh, Mary Ann Munsey, Bruce Stubberfield, Graham Carlin, Carol Barnden, Daryl Carter, Diana Hayes, Kay Sutton, Colin Wood, Isabel Strutt, Jim Walkinshaw, Narelle Solomon, Robin Wheatley, Bob Crouch, John Buckingham, and Peter Phillips. And then, of course, we moved on to the excellence in customer service for an employee. And the winner again, Urala Pharmacy, uh, Rachel uh, Kalis from Urala Pharmacy. The first runner up was Chloe Walters, who does a brilliant job uh, at the top pub uh, behind the bar. Uh, the second runner-up was tied between Bron Byers and Beck Frost, both from the award-winning TG's Childcare and Preschool. And they beat, beat out an amazing field of finalists. Emily McClanahan, Lisa Kelly Westbury, Nicola Frost, Abby Sweeney, Joe Fletcher, Amica Riley, Georgia Wright, Jamie Schultz, Phoebe McMillan, uh, Louise Shearer, Kelly Williams, Tony Swilkes, Michael Wellborn, Asaya Oleg Grennan, Joe Hull, uh, Petra Evans, Russ French, Rachel Goodwin, Lauren Gordon, Matt Jones. Uh, Trish uh, Binkhorn, Ruby Cramble, Lisa Westbury, Jack Stoker, Connor Campbell, Scott Harrison, Emily Harper, Kayleen Tobler and Jody Smith. And of course we came to the big award of the night, the excellence uh, in customer service for a business. The winner for the second year running was TG's Childcare and Preschool. Gail and her team do a magnificent job. The first runner-up was Urala Pharmacy and the second runner-up uh, Subway Urala and uh, an amazing field of finalists. The, Ur the Urala Pie Mechanic, Phil and his team, did a, do a great job there. Michael's Cafe, Foodworks, Kentucky General Store, Dale's Downtown Meets, Urala Chiropractic, 
Neighbourhood Centre, the Top Pub, Jason Small Engines, and the list goes on. Finally, I want to recognise Dale's downtown meats owner, Dale Goodwin. 15 years he's been in operation as a local butcher when a lot of butcheries are going out of business. He is an amazing success story. The Urala Business Awards was a great night showing off the best of Urala. Can't wait till next year.